Hey guys, I'm going to step it up to Taylor and tell you a hundred ways to annoy people. I'm going to try and read them all. Accuse people of glue sniffing addictions in public. Call other people champ or tiger. Refer to yourself as coach. Draw them on every available surface. Sing the Batman theme song all the time. Staple paper together in the middle of the page. Ask 1-800 operators on dates. So anti-theft detector strips into the back of people's backpacks. So whenever time they go through the door, a store it beeps. Hide dairy products in places hoping they will no odd places hoping they will go bad. Insist on giving weather forecasts in public. Claim to be AMS certified. Surprise old friends by visiting them at 3 a.m. to discuss old times. Insist on buying plane tickets for your friends to save money. Make sure the plane tick make sure the plane departs at 5 a.m. and the tickets are non-refundable. Point out that you didn't really save them any money. Write the, write the surprise ending to a novel on its first page. Specify that your drive through order is to go. Set alarms for random times. Learn Morse code and have conversations with your friends in public, consistently entering beep, 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 beep. Buy large quantities of mint dental floss just to lick the flavor off. Publicly investigate just how slow you can make a croaking noise. Honk and wave at strangers. Dress only in clothes colored hunter safety orange. Change channels five minutes before the end of every show. Wear your pants backwards. Decline to be seated at a restaurant. Simply eat their complimentary mints at the register. Begin all sentences with ooh la la. Leave someone's printer on the Atlantic setting, which is like this. Only type in uppercase. Do not use any punctuation. Buy a large quantity of orange traffic cones and reroute whole streets. Pay for your dinner in pennies. Tie jingle bells to all your clothes. Where was I? Repeat everything someone says as a question. Write X buried treasure in random spots on road maps. So the people reading them will be annoyed. Explain to everyone. That one's stupid. I tried to read that one already. Read the following conversation a dozen times. Oh, repeat the following conversation a dozen times. Do you hear that? What? Never mind. It's gone. Write up light road flares on birthday cakes. Wander around the restaurant asking other, di asking other diners for their parsley. Leave tips in Bulgarian currency. Demand that everyone address you as the conqueror or something. Push all the flat Lego pieces together tightly. At the laundromat, use one dryer for each of your socks. When Christmas caroling, sing Jingle Bells Batman Smells until you're physically restrained. Wear a cape that says Magnificent One. As much as possible, skip rather than walk. Stand over someone's shoulder mumbling as they read. Finish the 99 bottles of beer song. Leave your turn signal on for 50 miles. <clears throat> Pretend your mouse is a CB radio and talk to it. Charlie 6040, this is Big Billy. Come back. So like that, that's the only one I'm going to do something for. When walking, why walk when you can drive half a block? Name your dog, dog. Inform others that they exist only in your imagination. Ask people what gender they are. Reply to everything someone says, but that's what you think. Lick the filling out of Oreos and place the cookies back in back in the tray. Forget the punchline to a long joke, but ensure the listener that it's a real hoot. Routinely handcuff yourself to furniture, informing the curious that you don't want to fall off in case the big one comes. Sculpt your hedges into anatomically suggestive shapes like penises. I guess that's what they mean, or boobs or something. Follow a few paces behind someone, spraying everything they touch with a can of Lysol. Deliberately hum songs that will remain lodged in coworkers' brains, such as the Mr. Rogers theme song. While making presentations, occasionally bob your head like a parakeet. While beeping noise, make beeping noises. Fine, Mom, can you not bug me? I'm in the computer room! Stop talking! Really annoying. I was mean. While making presents, okay. Make beeping noises when a large person backs up. Leave your Christmas lights on up until September. 
then take them down for two months, and then put them back up. <laughs> Change your name to John A. Smith for the great glory of being first in the phone book. Claim it's a Hawaiian name and demand that the per people pronounce each A. Sit in the front yard. Sit in your front yard, pointing a hair dryer, passing cars to see if they slow down. Chew on pens that you have borrowed. Wear a lot of camouflage. Ask people if you may interface with them. Listen. Uh, sing along at the opera. Mow your lawn with scissors. Finish all your sentences with the words in acro dance with the F. Ask the waitress for an extra seat for your imaginary friend. Go to the poetry. Go to a poetry thing. Go to a poetry recital and ask each poet why it doesn't rhyme. Ask your coworkers mysterious questions and scramble them in and scramble the answers in a notebook. Mutter something such as psychological profiles. Insistently recite annoying phrases such as sticky wiki isn't criggy. <laughs> Stare at static on the TV, claiming you see the imaginary picture. Select the same song in the jukebox 50 times. Scruff your feet on a dry, shaggy carpet and seek out victims. Oh. Do not add any infliction to the end of a sentence, producing awkward silences, with the impression that you will be saying more at any moment. Never make eye contact. Never blink. Never make icon, never break eye contact, and never blink. Signals that the conversation is over by, by cupping your hands over your ears. Construct elaborate crop cycles in your front yawn. yard. Uh, give a play-by-play -play to something every person is doing while they play a sport or clean the house. Shout random numbers for someone is counting. Make appointments for the 31st of September. Invite lots of people to other people's parties. Why, when asked to do things, repeat instructions to the body part involved. Hand, will you please open the door? When people ask you to do things, mutter under your breath, that won't be necessary where you're going. Wait until you get, wait until you get back, wait until you get to work to shave. Tell small children that they won't um, look very promising when they grow up. That is the hundred ways to know people. I didn't read them all, but I tried, so... I'll see you guys. Sorry, I'm just trying to make the speech meter go to red. But uh, bye.